so today i literally woke up at 8 a.m for my 8 a.m appointment so what happened is um today's saturday by the way what happened is um i had an all-night prayer so yesterday i was at a virtual all-night prayer for my church and um i fell asleep when it ended like i'm knocked out and i never got to set an alarm to wake up so today i woke up at like eight in the morning and when i woke up i was hoping it was gonna be one of those situations where i wake up and it's actually six in the morning and i'm like oh i still have time no not this time Now this lady, I was telling her that, oh, you know, I've been here before. And this lady seemed to think that she was the one that helped me. I think she was like short-term memory or something. And she was like, yeah, I remember the last time when you were here, I had this thing on. And I was like, hey, man. Yeah, I remember. Totally. Wow. I was like, oh, oh my God. Wow. Wow. <laughs> so happy to see you without that thing, my girl. Oh my god! Just got my cover test done, guys. I'm super happy. Now I'm praying, 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 praying that it comes out uh, negative. Yo, please. I think that's the worst thing that could happen is if it comes out uh, positive. But God forbid it will never come out positive in Jesus' name. And you know, I don't know if it's just me now, but like when it's time for you to get a COVID test, I don't know if I'm the only one. Is it just me or your, your, your nose starts running? You know, your eyes start watering? You know, you still, your, your chest feels a little bit tighter. Like you start to have these, you know, a little bit of symptoms of COVID. Like when it's time for you to get your test, y'all. Is, is it really just me? Because every time I get tested, I remember even when I was going for surgery, same thing. I started to feel kind of like fluish, you know. So <laughs> came out negative though. So I'm praying you'll come out negative this time. Oh my gosh, guys! Yesterday, Shauna Ferguson passed away. Can you believe it? Like. Yo, 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 it's crazy guys. You know, when I first read about it, um, it was first it was still like unconfirmed. I was like, yo, I hope this is a rumor, I hope the internet is just killing someone again. You know, but then the they released it on his Instagram page an, an official statement confirming that he's passed away, guys. Like that is horrible, you know, like yesterday when I was at my night prayer, you know, I was just I started crying when I was praying, you know, and I was like, God, thank you that I'm alive, thank you that my family's alive, you guys know my family had a whole COVID, uh, not even a COVID scare, death scare, they had COVID and literally they almost passed away, and I had COVID, my whole family has had COVID in fact, and you know, just for us to still be here and alive is, is, some, is an act of God, it's a true miracle, how this woman has lost her life partner you know and she loved him so much and he loved her so much like again based on social media because we don't know them and we know social media is not real life so whatever we talk about guys let us take it with a grain of salt but based on the perception that we saw from social media like he loved her so much and they were so loud about their love and she loved him so much you know so now she's lost her husband her life partner and um his kids have lost their parents really sad man death be not proud you know if you're watching this right now say a quick prayer to thank god for your life even just to thank you god you know? my soul cries out hallelujah thank god for saving me so um i'm busy making breakfast for my family just for my mom my dad and chair because bo doesn't want anything he's making himself some ch crumb chicken or whatever so i'm just making them some breakfast that's my way of saying very well bye guys and that's it for today so yeah, I'm just gonna make them some sausages, bacon. This is me, but I really think bacon is overrated. Like I don't, bacon is not the girl who she thinks she is. What do you think? No, bacon is overrated. It's too, like it's not the girl that it thinks it is. school project 
you know this camera i feel like it's just not so clear guys is it in my head or what like let me try wiping so i feel like it's not so clear and i don't know if maybe it's my screen screen protector or what but anyway chair is interviewing me for uh, a school project it's something about my name chair, yeah. you're busy sitting down there being comfortable but if you are the one conducting the interview why are you not setting up the camera and stuff uh, i mean i'm waiting for your calls for our interview no i'm here for the interview you're interviewing me but you're not setting up the camera you're just sitting there the camera's not mine huh the camera's not mine yeah but still huh Oh, so we're just gonna sit here and be interviewed by nothing. Okay, can I set up the camera? Yes, yeah, set up the camera, Mr. Interview Man. You're asking me, even though you're the one interviewing. Even though it's your camera. Get it together, bro. It's your camera. Get, no, get it together. It's your camera. This is your interview. It's your You've camera. got to be prepared. It's your camera. Stay ready, because if you stay ready, you don't have to get ready. Ooh, look at me. Hi, man. Oh, There's the camera. Oh, I look good. I feel good. He's <laughs> listening along. Huh? Na, 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 na. I knew that I would now. Na, 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 na. I am your host, Chango Bemi. Today's topic is names. As you can see, I'm not alone. I'm here with my sister, Benita Danielle. Hi, guys. Benita Danielle is 22 years old and she is a YouTuber. She has 15.3 thousand subscribers on her YouTube channel. She attends university in America. She's an A student and she has been doing very well in school. She has four jobs in America. She is adventurous, she is strong, and she is confident. Oh, thanks, Chair. Okay, anyway, let's get into it. Two hours later. Before, it's before V, after V, sorry. There's also like, yeah. you know, Savannah. With him, with him. No. It's like, and it's also, you bath with it. What? Yeah, you bath with it also. <laughs> 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 so it's just a name, you bath with something. What do you bath with? So you, What do you bath with? <laughs> I bath with love. You do what do you bath with? You bath with water. What do you bath with? Wow. 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 So, bus club country state, my boy. So, what is that? But you do bus with the bus. You do! Which bus club do you guys? This is bus club for sleep. No! Sorry. But you see, guys, the problem with playing with married couples. No, 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 no. You don't be like, my aunt's favorite ice cream. Well, it's a privilege. You see, get married. That's what we say. Get married. Find your equal. Two seconds later. There we that's go. That's not true. That's not because no. I put the describer for the most Because you're cheating. That's clear. Because he did nothing but just show me my face who dice is reads, please. No! No, 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 no,
20 minutes later Hey guys, so I just finished doing my Black Excellence Series interview It's currently Sunday and we are still at Buns Out I am with Tish Tabang Elaine and they actually just came through to grab a bite with me after my interview and you asked guys so we're waiting for our food and then we're gonna get going have you guys had a good day yes. you know what Tish said she was like when you said you're doing the interview I didn't think you were interviewing Max <laughs> 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 Mm. Oh well, you know, full of, full of surprises, you know the boss. I was like, I hope he doesn't think I'm a group because now I'm taking all these videos. <laughs> and she was the trying scenes. to be slick, so I asked her to take behind the scene pics and she was literally like, taking it like this, <laughs> trying to be slick and I'm pretty sure he gave it to you. Okay, but guys, you Oh, he's not staring anymore. Okay, he was no. Okay, there we go. Yeah, he just he just he just waved. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So like literally, we're busy we're busy taking this vlog. You know what? People don't tell you about vlogging. Now we're in a group, so it's fine. But when you're by yourself, do you know how awkward it is? So we're standing outside, we're vlogging, and this man is just dead ass staring and waving. And now he's standing at the door looking. Okay, I think we should go back inside now. So. Tish is dropping. Hey guys, I'm Tish. If you never see this vlog, Tanita. <laughs> <laughs> guys, Lala, guys, we're gonna arrive home in Jesus' name. And she's a good driver. She actually drove me before. So, Hi, we're going on a trip in our You'll favorite our vacation. Vlog. Two hours later. Did you enjoy filming? Whew, difficult, but it's things that the world is facing. It's real things. Um, you are confronting real life issues mm. and you're going to touch a lot of lives you are going to change people's lives for mm. the better mm. i'm proud of you thanks so do you want your own youtube channel no bruh uh, do you miss me already huh i do i want to come in that's it why not there <laughs> the next day morning guys um it's 10 o'clock in the morning i woke up at around 8 a.m and i've showered so i'm leaving for america today and i did not pack my bags so yesterday after all the filming i did i was so exhausted i literally had no energy i packed half a suitcase and i was like i fell asleep um so um i went to go and renew my uh, license disc thing for my car um because it's gonna expire when i'm gone and then i had to get a printed version of my covid results which are a negative you know the vibes um and now i'm going back home to finish up my packing um i also need to take some of my clothes to dry clean uh so they can like sew it like fix it i want to pack it i want to go with it um so yeah i'm gonna go back and pack and then when i'm done i'm gonna go buy a few things that i want to go with um to america such as biltong 
whispers yes me i pack food guys i put it in my suitcase um what else do i need i think that's all that i need <laughs> Hello friends. Why are you making that face? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that you said oh readjusted and made the same face. Sorry. Hi guys. Is this your look when you join the army? You're gonna look at that's how you're gonna scare them. You're gonna <laughs> are you there to fight or are you there to be a model? She's gonna tell them, make peace, guys. We don't need to waste the resources. <laughs> we'll all be happier if we just love each other. <laughs> we'll all just come together and stop fighting. <laughs> so, this is my whenever I travel, this is how I weigh my bag. Um, it's like a little bag weigh thing, so you pretty much just tie it around your suitcase. The hard part is the fact that you have to literally pick it up. Oh my gosh. And wait for it to tell you the size. Ah! Okay. Ah. What is it? 22.7. So the maximum amount that, that your bag is allowed to weigh when you travel um, international is 23 kilograms. Depends on your airline, but I'm using Delta and they only allow 23. So this is 22.7. I forgot what I just said. And Seven. 22 point something also. So we're officially good to go. Unfortunately, I had to pull out my flannel. So I'm just going to tie this around my waist. And these beads, I'll put them in my suitcase. But pretty much, we're good to go. I've spent all freaking morning packing. And I hate packing. It is the worst thing. I hate packing. I hate unpacking. It's just... I, one day when I have money, I'm literally willing to pay someone. Ah, see, that depends. Well, it depends. <laughs> Clothing is real. Okay, it depends. But anyway, I just, I don't like packing. But I'm done packing my bags. These are my two suitcases. Um, and yeah, I'm just going to pack my backpack. Then we're going to record a YouTube video. And then we're done. What time is it? Three. Yeah. It's 3 p.m. I'm leaving at 6 so we're gonna, I'm gonna finish my backpack, pack my, no, no, no. I'm gonna do my backpack, do the video, then I'm gonna pack my camera stuff, and then we're gonna play my phone. We're gonna say goodnight on the phone, in the name of Jesus, and we give you all the glory. We pray, Father, for this blood flying. We cover this blood by the blood of Jesus. We cover the life in our lives by the blood of Jesus. <laughs> you see, that was so blunt, eh? That was so blunt. I'll see you in December. I'm definitely gonna come. What do you mean? Like you won't stop by when I'm not around, you know? Am I allowed to come by? You're not even like, man, let me know when I can come. No? I'll see you in December. <laughs> Yes, it was. <laughs> you want more thousands? Uh, yeah. Sorry. Let <laughs> me see your plate. Oh, so <laughs> I don't even know where it goes. No. Oh. Wait. No. <laughs> you packed. You Pop and meat. You packed a light airport snack. <laughs> Just something and light. And your, do <laughs> your dollars didn't buy this snack. So. <laughs> 